Recognition is an important part of the 4-H experience. Individual and group participation in learning and applying life skills is important for youth. Recognizing youth for their individual and group efforts and providing them with feedback helps them progress toward project goals. The 4-H recognition program includes five types of accomplishments or goals. Each goal is unique in the way it motivates young people to recognize their achievements. The five types of accomplishments 4-H measures for recognition are participation in educational experiences, progress towards self-set goals, achieving standards of excellence, excelling in peer competition, and excellence in cooperation in a group. Project books are an annual record of the 4-H'ers experience. There are guidelines in place for the proper completion of a 4-H record book. 4-H members can check with their 4-H club leader or the 4-H office for details on how to complete a record book. Completing a project book is required for Clover Award recognition and to receive 4-H event scholarships, as well as to compete at district and state contests. Throughout the 4-H year, members are encouraged to complete a record book for each 4-H project. Project record reports give youth an opportunity to document goals, experiences, achievements, and knowledge gained throughout the 4-H year. Each 4-H project must involve at least six hours of project work. Project books are due to the 4-H office at the end of May and are evaluated and then returned to the 4-H members at the annual awards banquet. For each project book completed, youth are awarded ribbons for their efforts. Blue ribbon record books will receive a pin that corresponds to the project book category. Members may enroll in as many projects as they choose. While they must understand that all projects may not be supported by programming efforts from the 4-H office. Some educational project workshops may be offered at the extension office. It is recommended that new 4-H members limit the number of projects so that they do not feel overwhelmed. Project record books are available from the 4-H office or you may choose to, your, to order yours from the 4-H mall. Check with your 4-H club leader or the 4-H office to find out how you can participate in the St. Johns County Clover Award program. Parent support is a requirement for youth receiving Clover Award camp scholarships. Summer camp scholarships are determined by Clover Award performance and funds available. Clover Award forms can be found on the St. Johns County 4-H website or can be picked up from the 4-H office. All funding and scholarships listed are subject to the funds available with the St. Johns County 4-H program. Partial scholarships for other 4-H events throughout the year will be determined by the 4-H office and will depend on the amount of money available as well as the number of youth participating. To qualify for 4-H scholarships, a 4-H'er must be actively involved at the club and county level. 4-H members who qualify to receive a full or partial scholarship to attend Florida 4-H University or 4-H Legislature, regional or state horse shows, or national judging events, or any other 4-H activity must submit a related project record book, show growth in subject area, assist with club or county level programs of subject matter that it corresponds with their interests, prepare an informational article for publication, and write a thank you note to the St. Johns County 4-H Association. There are also continuing education scholarships available to St. Johns County 4-H members who are seniors in high school. To qualify for these scholarships, youth must be graduating seniors in high school, have been enrolled as a 4-H member for the past three consecutive years, be active at the club 
county, district, and state level, and submit a completed senior 4-H portfolio. Scholarships are awarded based on the level of activity and commitment that a 4-H'er has demonstrated to the St. Johns County 4-H program. It is not guaranteed that all scholarships will be awarded each year.